are back here on Carolina <laughs> Women. Once again, we're at FWDG with our friend, Miss Angie. Good to see you. Good to see you All guys. right, Erin, well, continue. Shopping for TV consoles. And I was just saying, you know, when TVs kind of, um, the flat TV came on this, you know. Yeah. Scene. Scene. Everyone was starting to place them above the mantle. And that was kind this of a true. hard thing to embrace for me because we always kind of hid the TVs behind right. closed doors. But now it's pretty commonplace to make it yes. part of your room. They're very prominent now. That being said, the TVs are getting enormous. So how <laughs> do you offset that with a piece of furniture? Yes, well, that's what we're gonna talk about today. How to choose <laughs> the perfect TV stand, right? So the first thing that you wanna do is measure your TV, right? Um, do you know how to measure TV? Corner to corner? Yes, Diagonal? ma'am. Yes, Very good. Okay. diagonally. <laughs> and when you bring that measurement into us, just let us know what it is, right? And one of our design consultants will help you pick out the TV stand that will support the width of your TV. Very and you important. have those. Are, mm -hmm. there's, they're not custom orders, are they? Can we just come in and purchase one? Well, we specialize in customization. Oh. But yes, we do have. Right. It's both. So yes. we can get the big TV. Yes. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. You can have it as large as you want it. Wow. And I think more and more and more TV consoles are becoming the norm. I mean, mm -hmm. it's less about yeah. an armoire that closes off and it's more because they're so thin now. Yes. And they really look and can be disguised as a kind piece of streamlined. Of yeah, they really are. It's true. Um, when you walk into our store, we have in our Shrestless Gallery, mm -hmm. we have all of our TV consoles in there. So if you're shopping with us, take a look in there. One of our design consultants will direct you. Yes. And we have um, ones, we have different sizes, right? Because it's important to choose the size for your room. Correct. So you might want like a corner one for like if you have a bedroom, like a guest room yes. or something, because you want a, a small one, something mm -hmm. that doesn't take up a lot of space. Or you can go for a centerpiece mm -hmm. and really have it be the a focal, focal point, point of, your room. of your living room. So and what I noticed is all kinds of different styles, finishes, yes. looks, you know, ornamentation, mm -hmm. all that good stuff. We have a lot, we have a lot to choose from. So the ones in our store, those are mostly wood, because some people are concerned about, oh, will the TV stand support the TV? Both wood or metal are good. They'll equally support your TV mm -hmm. and all your accessories, all your, your storage. Does it have to match your other furniture? Heck like, no. No. <laughs> I should ask you that too. <laughs> good art does not match your sofa nor okay. your furniture pieces. <laughs> That's a good question. Yeah. Um, we do have a few fun pieces, like we have a red one. I've seen blue, we have teal. So you have different color options there mm -hmm. if you wanna really have some fun. Of course, though, I'm a matchy-matchy person. Mm -hmm. You too? I think so. Yeah, so if you want, <laughs> we have, we do have TV stands that come with whole collections. So you can get the matching coffee table, the end table. See, that makes you feel good. It does make me yeah. feel good. Thank you, Angela. You're welcome. You're I know. Welcome. Matchy, matchy. And you well, said no. that it has to be practical, too, mm -hmm. because nowadays we have stuff that we need to store somewhere. Yes. Um, with the mounted TVs, a lot of people think, oh, I don't need a TV console. I don't oh, need yeah, that. Oh, yeah, you do. But you do. It's great. It's a great place to put all of your like your video games, gaming console, yep. remote controls. Right? You don't want to lose those. Mm -hmm. No, we don't. <laughs> no, we don't. Right? Exactly. So, and we recommend um, based on the stuff you go with one that supports that has the amount of storage that will support everything. So, if you have a lot of stuff, get a mm -hmm. one with a lot of drawers. Um, and you can even have the ones with that have the combination, they have the drawers and they have the cabinets that open up. And most of those, is it true that because you need airflow, mm -hmm. that a lot yes. of them have built in or you can cut holes or put yeah. cords through? A lot of ours, they have, um, they have the areas there like cord organizers or okay. like the cutouts in the back where you can feed the cord through so it's not anything crazy. <laughs> right. Mm -hmm. And it keeps everything very organized. So yes, that is a good. So the furniture option. has evolved to the technology. Yes. <laughs> and so here is our takeaway for yes. today. <laughs> consoles are a must have. Media consoles are a must have, number one. Absolutely. Field trip to FWDG to look at them. Yes. yes. And you like symmetry. I do, and, but and you saw many, my room I designed. I did, and I was gonna say, it's ask for Aaron's room, it's designed. probably still there. It's great. <laughs> we wanna thank you, as always. It looks fabulous it in does. here. We thank wanna thank you. all of you for joining us, too, here on Carolina Women. Have a safe and wonderful week. Bye-bye.